Hello, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Dollar Tree Gold. So sorry, we have to be in the shower or the bathtub for this because I found two new Arm & Hammer body washes. So if you'd like to hear the difference between them, which one I like better, all that kind of stuff, then please keep on watching. Like it said, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell, bookmark the page, that way you never miss out on the daily uploads. Okay, so I have my ring light in here. Hope it's a little bit better. Anyway, so I love the Arm & Hammer 3-in-1 body wash. Sometimes you can still find them at Dollar Tree. I love the original Arm & Hammer Essentials. It comes in a white bottle, kind of like this. Anyway, I was at Dollar Tree a little bit ago. I've tried both of these, so this is not a first impressions. So I found two of the two new Arm & Hammer Essential body washes. So the first one is the exfoliating, exfoliating body wash with baking soda and it has natural silica particles in it and it's juniper berry scented so there's no dyes no parabens it's vegan it's a good body wash okay and then um, the other one I found is the moisturizing shower gel um, and it has moisturizing aloe vera and it is orange blossom scented so okay so I've tried both of these kind of want to go with pros and cons, you know, all that kind of stuff. So they're both 12 fluid ounce bottles, so a nice size bottle for a buck. Um, I do like that it's vegan. Um, it's not test on animals, all that kind of stuff. So um, the Refreshing and Nourishing Arm & Hammer Essentials Exfoliating Body Wash is specially formulated with the deodorizing power of Arm & Hammer baking soda, um, and the body wash will leave your skin feeling fresh and smooth. So, yeah. Um, this isn't my favorite. If you're gonna get one of the two, I definitely recommend getting the moisturizing one. I'll get into it in just a moment, but the reason why I don't really recommend this one a ton is I want you to see how thin it is, okay? It's like water. That's the body wash, okay? It's like super watery. And I've shaken it, I've done all that. It smells good. Um, so I like the scent, but it's just super, super watery where I feel like you need to use like a ton of it. So that's why I don't, like I said, if you can only afford one body wash from Dollar Tree, skip over the exfoliating one. The particles are really, really nice. I like that they're silica um, and not like the plastic beads that can, you know, get into the oceans or waterways or whatever like that. Nice scent but it's just, it's too watery for my liking. If you like a watery, um, thinner, you know, body wash, then you might really, really like the exfoliating one, the juniper berry scented one, because it does smell really good. But like I said, just a little too watery for me, in my opinion. So that's why I will definitely use this up, but I would personally repurchase this. So fortunately, this one is not a Dollar Tree Gold. It smells really good. I like it, but it's just... Not my favorite, it's too liquidy. I'm gonna stop talking about it being liquidy now. Okay, so the moisturizing one. Definitely like this one a lot. Really, really nice. So, um, once again, it's made with the Arm & Hammer deodorizing baking soda. It'll leave your skin feeling um, moisturized. So, like I said, it does have aloe vera in it and uh, this stuff is Awesome, this is the one I'm gonna be using tonight to show you. It smells like a real orange. It doesn't smell like artificial orange. It's not super strong. It's not like you just cut it open an orange on your kitchen counter or anything like that, but it definitely has a natural orange scent to it. So, but I mean, just kind of see the difference. Do you see the difference between the exfoliating one and then the moisturizing one? The moisturizing one is thick it's got a nice nice viscosity to it so just went ahead and put some on my little loofah also from Dollar Tree of course oh, it smells so good suds up great I've used this with my washcloth so if you don't like bath poofs you can definitely use a washcloth I'm not a wash like put soap in between my hands and but you know it would work fine that way as well. So no matter what kind of medium you like to use, um, the uh, moisturizing body wash would uh, suds up great.
This stuff rinses great. No kind of residue left on your skin or your shower, which is awesome. It's not as moisturizing as like, let's say, like the Nivea body wash, but it's it's pretty darn close, but it's like a lightweight moisture. It doesn't leave me feeling goopy or, yeah, I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, I really, really love this stuff. Um, so I always feel like spring and summer is a great time to try a new body wash. I don't know why, but uh, yeah, definitely recommend this one. Um, the moisturizing one, the orange blossom scented, it's clear, so you can see like the orange liquid inside. So love this stuff, absolutely amazing. And as long as my Dollar Tree has it, and if I ever need body wash, it doesn't matter if I have the money to go to like Walmart or whatever to buy it, I will definitely buy this again. It's just a really nice body wash. I think it'd be great for all year round. I've shaved with it. It's just really, really good. Definitely worth more than a dollar. So yeah, if you liked the other, like the regular, I have it somewhere, I can't find it. Somewhere in my big giant, uh, yeah, somewhere in here. And uh, I, it's cluttered again, of course, because you know me. But yeah, if you like the original um, Arm & Hammer Essentials body wash, um, I think you'd really, really like the Orange Blossom Moisturizing one. Really, really good. So yes, this one is definitely a Dollar Tree Gold. But like I said, the exfoliating one with the Juniper Berry, it's not a bad body wash. Um, if you're looking for one that is exfoliating, then yeah, you'd probably really, really like this one. So, you know, either way, you're, you're not gonna be disappointed unless you absolutely hate super thin body washes like I do, but both good. Um, I recommend both just for different types of people and different types of needs at once. So there we go. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this week's Dollar Tree Gold. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments. Have you seen either one of the new Arm & Hammer Essentials body washes at your local Dollar Tree? I would love to know down below. And just so you know, I uh, do have a Macari page where I sell discount makeup, beauty, skincare, hair care, all sorts of stuff. I also have a little Facebook group where we kind of hang out and chat and find and you know post our good finds and stuff like that. So I'll have those linked down below for you. And of course, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media: Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all about your glam babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start autoplaying here very shortly. You can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.